Local pride groups and supporters turned out in huge numbers at City Hall last night as part of a counter-protest in response to a demonstration that happened yesterday morning. That initial protest saw about 60 people call against the teaching of sexuality and gender identity in schools. The rally last night attracted nearly 300 people who say they want to support youth trying to be who they truly are. And especially thanks to everyone who's fought for where we are now. The gathering was called Love Always Wins. Members of the Gay Straight Alliances from several local high schools were among the special guests at the rally and spoke about their struggles to be themselves and choose pronouns to match their identities. Local politicians also took to the microphone to share their personal stories and offer support. Officials with Rainbow Collective and Thunder Pride say they were deeply encouraged by the large turnout. I think it went awesome. It's such a good, like, just look at the turnout. It's an awesome turnout of love and support for a community that just faces bigotry for absolutely no reason um, from people who don't even know what's going on in the schools and refuse to educate themselves about what's going on in the school curriculum and what our children actually learn. My thoughts on the, on the, the one this morning are you know, they're entitled to their uh, protest, but uh, it is misinformation, it is disinformation, it is dangerous rhetoric that they are spewing that are making lives of trans and non-binary kids in school unsafe. And safety is the paramount concern right now of students who are just trying to live authentically who they are. And we have to keep fighting for them every step of the way.